Before we practice our numbers, today we are going to add the last two that we're going to talk about right now. First of all, we have 19, a 1 and a 9. And this is the last number in the teen numbers. They go from 11 to 19. After 19, when you count, you have 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, what comes next? 20. 20. You kind of hear the two part up here, 20. That two is the first part. And that means you have two groups of 10. Remember when we count by tens, we go 10 and then 20. So two, and, the t and it means that there are two groups of 10 and you have zero left over. So I'm gonna stick these in. This one is 19. This one is 20. I'm gonna put them in, hide them in the rest of our numbers, mix things up a little bit. Oop, put one backwards I did. Mix things up a little bit, and then we'll say our numbers. All right, here we go. 8, 17, 5, 15, 1, 3, 19, 2, 4, 13, 7, 18, 11, 6, 9, 20, 10, 16, 12 and 14. Keep practicing these numbers, guys. All right, I have something to show you, something new that we haven't used yet. This is called counting flowers. Now, what it is, you see a three right here in the middle. We need to find out what comes before for number three, and what comes after number three. When we find the numbers that come after, we keep counting three, hmm, hmm. And you could do that real easy, three, four, five. When we have to count what comes before, the easiest way to do is count backwards. And we practice this when we do our calendar. So let's practice counting backwards. Three, two, one. So I'm gonna fill in the numbers. Let's count backwards. Three, two, one. Now let's go further. One, two, three, four, and five. Okay, I'm gonna put that one to the side and let's take this one. All right, let's go. We wanna find out what comes before this number. What is this number? Seven, all right, let's count backwards, seven, Six, five. Okay, let's count up, go up and get bigger. Five, six, seven. What comes next? Eight and nine. 
Good. All right, let's do another one. Let's do this one. Let's go backwards. Six, five, four. That's our first number. Then we have number five. Then number seven. And number eight. There you go. Four, five, six, seven, eight. Good job. Okay. I think I did my seven backwards. Sorry, guys. There we go. All right. If I got any numbers backwards, forgive me. It's a little hard for me to go backwards. All right. Let's go again. 10, 9, 8, 8. So we have 8, 9, 10. What's next? 11 and 12. Eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve. Good job. And we're going to do one last one for today. I wish I had a whole lot more of these because they really can help you uh, not just learn your numbers, but help you to fill in your numbers if you're missing a different or missing a number. So here we go. Twelve. 11, 10. We got to start with 10. 11, 12, 13, 14. There you go. We'll do some more of these another time with some bigger numbers, but for now, that's all today. Keep counting. <laughs>